And you. you, and you. Yeah. Good, good. Great to see you. Great to see you. We're rolling. Yeah. We're rolling. So year five, you've now burned through five Cert theatres. Well, no, four Cert theatres and the Smith Centre. Where do you go next? Uh, we love to work within our theatre because it's an environment we control better. And having our creators and artists working together to create for us a surprise show because we have nothing to do with the content of that event, right. and that's what makes it very special. So, um, how how is running Cirque now that the founder is no longer uh, in charge? Right. He, the founder is on a yacht in Hawaii or Thailand somewhere. <laughs> so you'll see the founder tonight because he's going to be here and he was in Montreal in our studio last Friday. He still owns 10% of the company and I pull him a lot every time we, we do a new show because he's still a gifted creator and I still want to have him around. Right. He can't give, a, give it up completely. Oh no, oh no, and we don't want him to give it up because he's such a, a great creator. Um, have you reached maximum now in, in Las Vegas with certain shows? Or is there room for something new and different? I think there is always room for stuff that are new. And so what we have been doing with the new owners, we have increased our marketing span in Vegas and we saw great results. So for the first time last year, we, were, we sold more tickets than ever before. And this year, at the beginning of the year, we still are better than last year. So, so right now, we're not only stabilizing our business in Vegas, but we're growing it. And from there, if ever there are something available and we have a content for it, we'll never stop. We love this city. Do you think that you will find content for show number nine? I, I think the key, Robin, frankly, is I don't think there is more room for another acrobatic show in town. So I think we, we dominate this market and we should, we should stabilize that. But if ever someone, one of our creators, come with an idea that we think could work in, in Vegas, we'll look into it. So the, the uh, sign of success for a show is when you can't buy tickets. Um, I was talking with Myron Martin at Smith Center the other night. And he says that Cirque and Smith Center now have a problem with scalper tickets. And uh, that you are trying to think of ways to come back to scalper tickets. Is that a big problem for Cirque? Yeah, it is. Because uh, as you know, if you take you know, a show like Oh and Michael Jackson and Love, people are trying to have those tickets. And, uh, and, and I'm always sad when I see that the customer is paying three times the price of our ticket. It's not good for the industry. It's not good for our purchase, it's not good for our company. How do you stop it? Uh, I don't know. If I would know, I would stop it right away. Uh, I think it's becoming more and more a problem. Not only for Cirque, it's a problem for rock concert stars. It's a, it's a huge issue, and so far we haven't found the solution. It's illegal under federal law for robots to uh, go into booking systems. Yeah. It took seven layers of security for Smith Center to stop the robots going in for the Hamilton tickets. Seven layers of security I know, I know. Uh, to stop the robots. And, and, and we do a lot of uh, research and development with our technology IT team in order to, uh, to help solve it. Well, let's hope it's solvable. I certainly hope so. Because you, you can't do uh, one night if you don't do <laughs> solve that problem. Exactly. Always good to see Thank you, sir. You, Thank, Thank you, Thank you. So Congratulations again. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. How are you? Very good. Need to talk to you a second. No, you can do so How does it feel to be away from the baby? I know you have 10% of the baby still. But how does it feel to be? That's right. I'm still involved with the baby. Uh, every creative project, uh, we're I'm still part of the creative uh, uh, team in terms of uh, looking into what show we're we'll doing. So I'm just away from the administration management of it. But I have my and for me. Um, this is a huge do you miss that part of it? You know, I'm not the type of person who's missing things in life. I make this event, I go to forward. But I carry it in my heart uh, every day when I'm It was my baby, and, uh, and the baby's still walking very good, so very nice. So now you have one night, the charity, one drop, the charity, and you have 
uh, the Golf <laughs> Venture, which is headquartered now in. How excited uh, are you to see the show today? Are your hands still full? Mm -hmm. Yeah, my, well, like I said, uh, I've, I've been working a lot on my new project, which I cannot disclose now. Whoa. Not now. Is it entertainment driven? Of course. Of course. Some of it. Uh, Will we see it in Vegas? We're still I don't know yet. Maybe. There's some, actually, it's one of the events I'm involved in. It's a matter uh, we're there. We're there. Master we're there. series of, of, of uh, right. that we'll use. So, uh, that's, a, that's, that's a good one. I mean, it should be some, some, some interesting things. So I'll diversify my, my investment. A lot of new stuff. We're, we'll announce that by the end of the year. Yes? Not now. You're not going into space again? No. <laughs> no. Been there, done that. No, no, but uh, we're, uh, we're auctioning the charity tonight. Uh, 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 a ride with me in, uh, in uh, very fast, uh, the Formula One of the, oh, the, the, the speed bump rivalry. goes like 350 km. Really all about that. <laughs> so we'll see all those little people. That should be fine. Thank you, as always.